My name is Steve Votier, I'm a senior lecturer in natural environment at the Environment and Sustainability Institute. I describe myself as a seabird ecologist, so I'm very interested in understanding how marine birds, understanding about their biology, understanding about their ecology, and particularly understanding how they respond to changes in the marine environment. Seabirds are a very threatened group of birds, they're the most threatened group of birds currently in, in the world. So there's a number of ways that we can protect these, these animals. The first thing is to protect them in the areas where they nest. The second thing which is key is to try and conserve areas at sea that are important to them for foraging, for migration, for uh, overwintering. Uh, marine birds are very, very much at, um, at the heart of a lot of that research, so using them as kind of indicators of, of marine hotspots is something that's quite an important way to preserve populations of, of seabirds. For a number of years now we've been using technology to try and inform our research and so making use of miniaturised tracking technology, so whether it be GPS loggers or whether it be miniaturised depth recorders. Um, it's been really instrumental in, in developing an understanding of the way in which seabirds use the marine environment and one of the key developments there has been using um, birdborne video cameras and yes yeah, some of this footage has revealed not only the way in which the gannets interact with for example fisheries but also how they interact a lot with each other. There's a, there's a couple of key things about the ASI that's, that's, that's great from my point of view. I think the first thing is people. I think there's a really dynamic diverse group of, of people here who are interested in a wide variety of topics and I think drawing on, on this interdisciplinarity is, is really key to what I do. It's a nice environment, quite sociable, quite friendly and quite collegiate and I think that's really key. So, so yeah, the ESI is, is a very welcoming and fostering environment to, to work in I think.